It's okay. Am I talking? Tell me when. Oh, you've started, and, oh. and I'm not. I'm not editing <laughs> this out. Yeah, thanks. Wait, wait. Uh, the reason we are here is because basically it's the only um, place we can get some solace and quiet. To be serious, um, I've attempted to be serious on numerous occasions, but I've been disrupted by uh, my fellow colleagues here. So basically, trying to trying to explain what we're doing, why why are we here? Well, it's a very good question. Basically, um, it's a threefold answer. Three, there's three things that we're doing at the moment, and um, to be honest, with this will be our eighth United album. That's a lot. That's like it's like up there with like bands who've been around for 20 years, and we're all we're all still very young, and uh, and you know what? they'll still be they'll still be young in 10 years' time. Just letting everybody know. But um, but basically, one thing we've never wanted to do is just do the same thing for the sake of it, and uh, and God really put it on our spirit to do something different. Um, with the opportunity that we've been given and, and in our travels and in, in being able to go around and just you know meet young people all around the world and uh, experience them and their expression of faith you know, um, really felt it on our spirit to kind of try and capture that and try and do something that captures the kind of like what God's doing around the world within youth ministries in young people just real people living real lives and getting real with God and, and so that's what we're doing it's called the I Heart Revolution but that's going to take a little while for us to put together and believe me it's going to be great but in the meantime you know we were going to do another album at Encounter Fest but we felt like it would be good to do something different so uh, we're doing so three projects one down that leaves two um, this one that we're working on at the moment is 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 the other one and we could call this whatever you like doesn't have a title yet feel free to make one up and send your suggestions to hills.com <laughs> don't do that but uh because <laughs> that's scott's email <laughs> and he's editing this and he said he wasn't going to stop it but anyway um we, we don't have an album title for this one but basically it's a studio project and we wanted to the songs we're, we're writing and that we're bringing our songs that you know hopefully you can do it you know, in any youth service, be it on an acoustic guitar or a piano or a kazoo or whatever you feel gifted at, uh, <laughs> <if I, laughs> Scott's obviously found that funny. Scott's actually quite gifted at the kazoo. Um, but yeah, the songs are just, the songs, they're, they're from our heart, the songs that our team have written and that we're bringing in, we're just bringing it to it in a different format and hopefully you'll enjoy it. It's something that we haven't done before. Um, not to any great effect anyway so uh, the challenge is out there and to be honest we're having an absolute ball and, and we've basically just been worshipping in a room and uh, and capturing that and so hopefully that's what you'll get and I believe that it's going to be splendid and the third thing we're doing this is exciting this is the first time anybody's heard this news is at summer camp which is like my favourite thing that we do as a youth ministry summer camp is like Basically, when we just get all our young people and we get together in the middle of nowhere at the beach and we just get real with God. And basically, um, that's the spot where, where, where God, he does something there every year. And, and we decided that we'd do something there. We'd record uh, live at summer camp, except for it won't be us, except for it will be us. We're doing a project with all the younger fellas. And what do you, what's the colloquial term for female um, and well, in Australia we'd say Sheila's, but I don't say that ever. We call them the girls, all the young dudes and the young girls. And um, we haven't got a title for that either. We don't know what it's going to be called. But basically, we just have the best young people in our youth ministry. We've got young guys who are killer songwriters, amazing worship leaders, anointed by God. We have these young musicians who are just ripping on their instruments. And basically, we're giving them a chance. We're unleashing them and saying, you know what, go for it. And, uh, and it's going to be killer. And I've heard some of the songs that they're writing and they're, they're amazing. And so um, that is very, very exciting. Except for that one there, you're going to have to be pretty smart and pretty cluey about how we're going to release that because I'm not sure how we're going to do it, whether it's going to be a big CD that everybody gets or whether you're going to have to search for it or whether we'll do something online. Um, either way, I'm talking a lot and maybe talk too much. Maybe I've said too much. Maybe I haven't said enough. Um, this is going to be great. I'm glad that all you people who've listened to me for the last three and a half or four minutes have come along for the journey and uh, it's going to be exciting.